Capricorn, welcome back to Angels Light Tarot. Thank you, thank you, thank you for stopping by for your weekly love message for October the 14th through October the 20th. Angels and guides, angels and guides, what is going on? What is going on in your love arena these seven little days? What is going on, angels and guides? Angels and guides, we're looking for all the positive energy that we can for Capricorn in the green room, in the heart chakra. You're like, get on with it, okay? Stop chatting, Kathy. All right, all right, what is going on? What is going on? Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. That's too many, that's too many messages. <laughs> what is going on in the love department? I know you're like, come on, come on, come on. I just wanted, want you to see that. All right, do, do, do. If this is taking too long, just, yeah, that's all you gotta do. Okay, that's it. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Two more, two more. What is going on? What is going on? Mm -hmm. A lot of pages. One more, one more page. I mean, one more page. One more, one more message. One more message, angels, for the love department of Capricorn. You know that music that you hear um, when you're on the elevator <laughs> and you're just waiting? Elevated music. I don't even know if they have LOV, elevator music anymore. That's like, am I like telling? There we go. Telling my um, my age here. It's okay. I don't care. <laughs> it's okay. I don't care. All right. What is going on? We want to make sure we get all the good energy out of these cards here. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. What is going on? Thank you, angels. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Thank you. Thank you. Wow. Oh, my. Thank you, angels. Thank you. Thank you. Whoa. Okay. What is going on? What is going on in the love department for Capricorn? <laughs> okay. So, main theme for you. You're like, finally, right? It's been two minutes. Okay. So, main theme is the chariot card mm -hmm. with the four of hearts and the ten of spades so i feel like love is in the air <laughs> i feel like it's like love is definitely coming towards you okay and this love is secure yeah it's it's like family kind of love it's like security kind of love it's like love that's like it's in, it's like you know when you go home you open the, you put your key in the door you open the door and you're like you're leaving the whole world behind. It's and you, and you walk and you're like, you know what? I'm home. It's that kind of love, okay? And it's successful. I feel like yes, there's a lot of love that there's a lot of work that's surrounding this love, but it's definitely successful love. So do you say, is it worth it? I say it's worth it, okay? All right, now, in the recent past, in your love life, you had an eight of cups. I feel like someone left and came back, right? And with the eight of spades, I feel like there was power in that. I feel like when they left, I felt like, I don't know why, I feel like they were pushed out. Yeah, I definitely feel like someone was energetically pushed out and then they came back energetically, emotionally. Um, definitely someone was energetically pushed out. Now, now, that was the past. This is right here and now, in the middle of the week. We have the four of wands, the nine of hearts, and the 10 of clubs. So in the home, once again, I feel like it is definitely a happy home. I feel like it is, it gives you peace. It gives you a lot of peace. Are you doing work in this home? Yes, you are doing a lot of work. You are giving a lot of love. Even I feel like there might be times in the middle of the week where you feel like, you know what? My baby don't deserve my love today, right? Today. But I see that you're saying, you know what? No, he or she does not deserve my love today, but I'm still going to give it to him or her. Yeah, I'm still going to, because you know what? I know that, I know, I know exactly what to say. I know exactly what to say to make everything a-okay. And I know you do. I know you do. Okay. All right. Now, by the end of the week, you have the page of swords mm -hmm, with the eight of diamonds and the four of spades. So you guys are waiting for a message. I feel like it's a message, a communication. I feel like it definitely, definitely comes, right? And it brings security in you guys' love life. Yes, it does. Now, now. The Page of Wands, 
is reversed, okay? With, I feel like, I feel like with the, I don't know why, but I'm feeling like, I feel like the Page of Wands is reversed, but I feel like the Ten of Cups is not reversed with the Six of Spades and the Ace of Diamonds and the Six of Hearts. I'm feeling like it's not. I feel like you guys are waiting for um, something to happen, something to move forward, some energy you're waiting for. It might be a letter, it might be a communication, um, it might be a message about traveling or changes or, or something like that. And I feel like you're just waiting, you're just waiting, right? But while you're waiting, while you're waiting, yeah. You guys are happy, you know what I mean? You guys are surrounded by love and, and joy. And I feel like this love and joy is constant. It is consistent. No matter, no matter whom, if someone needs to give more love than the other person, I feel like, you know, it's it all balances out in the end because this love is it's a long lasting love. And this ace of diamonds is telling me that whatever message that you guys have been waiting for, I feel like it definitely comes, this financial message, it comes, and it just it just solidifies the relationship even more and more that you know that you it, it makes you go, you know what? This is this is my soulmate, this is the love of my life. This is I feel like um I feel like Will you be giving a little bit of love this week? Will you be stepping up and giving love to someone, to them, when you feel like they're being, um, I feel like a little maybe immature this week. I feel like you're still going to give them love and because you know they're your soulmate, right? Um, yeah. It's almost like this love isn't going anywhere. It's like, going on and on and on and on, but you know, that's a good thing, that's a good thing, okay? Like this person I feel like will always be in your life. I mean, let leave a comment below, let me know, do you feel this person will always be in your life? Because it looks like they're coming back, like I, like, I feel like emotionally, um, in the past they kind of let their emotions go, like disappeared, and then now they're coming back, but it, it might not even have been a physical disappearance, it might have just been an energetic, like taking their love back, and now I feel like they're giving it again, and it's it's good, it's, it's powerful, and it's bringing um, peace in the home, and even if, even if that person feels like you don't deserve it or, or you feel like they don't deserve it, I feel like it's given nonetheless, and it's bringing, um, you know, abundance, it's bringing abundance, it's bringing joy. So it's, it's like, if it's you that has to do, give that extra bit of love to make things great, you know, it's like, go ahead, do it. And if you're the cross watcher and you're the person who has to give that extra bit of love to make things great, then go ahead and do it because you know what? It's better to be happy, right? It's better, to, you know you're not going anywhere so you might as well make things as wonderful and beautiful as you can, okay? So I send you joy, namaste, and much, much love sent you.